God wants you to hear this message, but the devil wants to put a million distractions in front of you to try to get you to not hear this. So I encourage you to share this message with somebody else so that they can receive this truth as well, but you do not have to. In Matthew 4, 18 through 19, it tells us how Jesus was walking on the Sea of Galilee, and he saw Peter and Peter's brother Andrew casting their nets into the water because they were fishermen. And Jesus came up to them and told them, Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. You see, when you cast a net into the water, it gathers fish. But when Jesus said this, he wasn't saying that you would actually throw a literal net and catch people. As followers of Christ, we are called to spread the good news, and we are called to expand the kingdom as much as we can. So what we do is we use our voice. The voice is the net, and we cast it to people and we gather people by the word of God. Whether that be spreading the word to your dad, your mom, your daughter, your son, your friend, your neighbor, it doesn't matter who it is. The world needs to know the truth. The world needs to know that there's hope in this fallen world. The world needs to know that there is a shoulder to lean on in times of difficulty. The world needs to know that there is a source of salvation. There is something beyond the life that we see and the life that we live and that is Jesus. Do you know what the word can do in someone's life who does not know Christ or who is lost? Because it can change their lives more than just Jesus loves you, but actually sitting down with that person, having a conversation with them and explaining to them how much Jesus has done for us, how much he has planned, and how we are saved by the blood of Jesus. So I encourage you to tell someone about Jesus and his goodness and his mercy. Don't worry about the criticism. Don't worry about getting judged for spreading the truth. Jesus tells us in Matthew 5:10, blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. So let's get together as brothers and as sisters and win souls. So if you agree with this message, comment amen and share this with the first person that you think of because it can change their lives.